In this video, I'll go over two different ways you can password protect your spreadsheet in LibreOffice Calc. Hi, my name is Michael with Office Nifty. I make quick tips and video tutorials on how to use Calc software. The first method to protect your spreadsheet is just to apply a password to the file. The second method is to protect your sheet but still allow it to be viewed. So I'll go over the first scenario now. All we have to do is go to File and save the file. The Save As dialog appears as usual, so we can give this a name. And the important part is here, we make sure to choose Save With Password and hit the Save button. Now the Set Password dialog appears and we can type in a password. and then choose OK. Now the file is saved. I can go ahead and try to close this file. And now I went back to where I saved the file. Now choose Open. And this is the dialog where it asks for my password. If I type in the wrong password, let's see what happens. It tells me the password is incorrect and it cannot be opened. So it prompts me for the password again. This time I put in the right password and I'm granted access to view and edit any of the sheets within my calc file. All right, the second method is to protect the sheet but allow it to still be viewed. So here I'll just put in some example numbers as data. And to protect my sheet, I go to the Tools menu and choose Protect Sheet. Here the Protect Sheet dialog appears and I could put in my password. You could choose whatever you want to use, but make sure not to forget what it is. Otherwise, we're unable to remove the password protection and edit it after the fact. Down here we have some options to allow a user to have a little bit more permission even while the sheet is protected. So I'll just select a few of these. Now choose OK. So now if I try to type in some values in a different cell, it gives me an information dialog that says protected cells cannot be modified. If I try to change this number to some other number, I get the information dialog again. Now earlier I allowed the password protected to be able to insert rows. So I'll test that out. Insert rows below and we see I'm able to add a new row. But if I try to type in some text here, I get the information dialog again, which does not allow me to edit any of the cells. If I want to delete the value, I press a delete or backspace key and it doesn't allow me to change the value. So essentially, I've protected my sheet here, but we could still click around and do a couple things which I've allowed the user to do that will preserve the data of the sheet. Now I just added a new sheet and you can see the difference that sheet one has a lock icon next to it, signifying that it is protected. To remove the protection, I can just go back to Tools and choose Protect Sheet again. It prompts me for my password in order to remove the protection. Now it is possible to apply protection to the sheet without a password and it'll still work to protect the sheet. That could be an even better option because then you won't accidentally forget which password you use. Then you can simply unprotect the sheet without having to type in any passwords. But for now, I'll put in the password I used to remove the protection. And now we notice the lock icon is gone. And I'll try and type in some value in here. And now we're back to the regular edit mode of the sheet. So that's it for today's quick tip. I hope you found this helpful. If you have any questions about using Calc, feel free to mention it in the comment section below. Thank you for watching, and as always, stay nifty.